I should say, on an aside, uh, Mr. Speaker, that I was surprised uh, to see uh, comments from the governor this morning in the press uh, expressing views on the MOUs and on whether the agreement was good or bad for Gibraltar. Uh, the governor is, of course, a representative of the crown. He is the queen in Gibraltar, and he has been a good governor. He is a popular and good governor, but he should not be uh, immersing himself in matters of local political controversy. It would have been as strange as if Her Majesty had expressed a view at the height of the differences between the Labour Party and the Conservative Party as to whether the withdrawal agreement negotiated by Theresa May w was good for the UK. It was inappropriate for His Excellency to express views on matters of local political controversy. He is the crown in Gibraltar. He fulfills a ceremonial function. He is the queen uh, in Gibraltar. And on the eve of his departure, expressing views on issues of controversy, such as the MOUs and the tax treaty, cross the customary line, and as a matter was a matter of dismay of, uh, for all of us on this side of this house, I speak for at least the GSD.